Hello, I'm Dr. Maxim Chumak here at Maxim Medical Robotic Hair Transplant in Fort Lauderdale. We're here with Percy. He had his procedure two days ago. Uh, it was also robotic hair restoration. We took uh, the grafts from the back of his head and transplanted it right there. And you can and you can hardly see that anything was done. So, two days after the procedure, and uh, it was taken robotically. Very precisely, we use the smallest uh, punch. What is important about robotic technology, we can actually decrease the size of the punch. So right now, we use a 19 gauge, it's just about a 0 0.8 millimeter of size. That's why you don't even, even after two days, the procedure was done, you can hardly see that anything happened there. And once the hair grows a little bit, it's gonna be completely undetectable, unless you use a magnification glass. But anyway, um, uh, he went for high bear treatment, uh, just came back uh, yes. to check on the wound, we removed the dressing, everything look, looks good. How's your overall experience from the beginning? I, it was excellent for me. It was the best experience because the feeling of getting back some of the hair that I had lost, it, it, just, it just automatically, it makes you feel good, you know. Uh, besides that, there was no pain. It wasn't like like all the, the myths that people think. They think they're gonna go and they're gonna rip hair and it's gonna hurt and all. That. It wasn't nothing like that. It, the technology today is is excellent. I recommend it for anyone that is that is having uh, a need to to get a hair transplant. You know, there's no need to be walking around anymore with you know without hair. It's like hair is something that makes you feel confident it, it's good for business it's good for love it's good for everything it's good for for your own self-esteem so i totally recommend it it was no pain no swelling no really any problems at all you know I, i'm i'm very happy with the procedure and i totally recommend max and medical yes right. and, and you and you uh you you pretty much you went straight forward you had your lunch right yes and then, i went right out of there went to right. eat and uh, mm -hmm. you know had no problems uh, i i didn't I, I didn't even have a problem in sleeping because once you put the pillow around your neck it kind of like keeps your head right off you know propped up yes. so there's not a problem even you know when you sleep or anything and the the, the whole stuff will you know, take good care of you. They're very good people, you know. And uh, so now today, do you have to take any pain medication at all? I haven't taken, I was, you know, I did get the pain medication from the pharmacy, but I haven't had the need. There was no pain, um, very mild itching, which we have to spray for it. And, right. and it really doesn't, you know, it's not like, like something that you really feel like going crazy. It's just a very mild. You know, and I'm keeping my my cap, my shower cap on to to try to, you know, keep all the the dust and things away. Perfect. So it's it's healing really nicely. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, even for two days. And we will show you some close-up pictures in just mm -hmm. a little bit. You'll see that it's almost completely healed. It's it's unbelievable. Healed. Unbelievable. The, the, the healing process, is, for some reason, I thought it was going to take longer too. And I'm, it's only the second day, and I'm already. You know, feeling like you know, actually better than I did before I came right. over because I, I went to the hyperbaric, uh, hyperbaric chamber, which is a really good thing to do after you do the procedure. You know, and it actually accidentally helped me to feel no pain because I suffer from back pain and mm -hmm. all this on. And now it's actually helping me in other ways that I didn't know it was going to. Yeah, it's not something we do at Max Medical. We refer every patient to hyperbaric treatment that. Um, um, uh, people go for 60 minutes into mm -hmm. the tube, uh, atmosphere of pressure with high pressure oxygen and there's a very uh, lot of clinical uh, uh, proof that it actually helps to to heal uh, uh, wounds faster, to help with a lot of health yes. issues and uh, to help with the better graft. Uh, yes, it, ha it has uh, excellent benefits for, for anyone that has, you know, uh, it actually it stimulates the growth of the of the grafts and, and, and everything. And but besides that, it's just good for you. It's a very healthy thing to do. Yes. You know. Perfect. So about the strip procedure, right? Were you your surgeon uh, uh, strip procedures in, in, 
you know, the, the older methods of hair transplant before? I, no, I never, but, uh, but I seen, and, and that was one of the reasons why I used to have fear, you know, to go because you had to be more, you know, uh, I was a little more intrusive for what some of my friends done. Right. They, they had to take a graft uh, out of the back and then they'll implant it in the front. It's not even like that anymore. It's robotic. You you can't go wrong. It's like the, the robot is precise. will take the best of your hair one by one and then they'll put it one by one. It's not like you're going to see three, four hairs, plugs. Or, it's perfect. It's, okay. it's really good. All right. Thank you very much for thank sharing your experience. I truly appreciate your help. Thank, thank, you. thank you so much.